spill venom out the side of my pores. We came to battle, we came for war. Digging in the mud, carry across the globe. No matter the weather, rain, sunny or snow. I guess all the sacrifice was worth it. The pain made perfect and gave me a purpose, yeah. And I still don't get no breaks. And you about to learn why if you in my yeah. way. You know who's up in the house tonight. The champions are back in your town. Feel the stands and make them shout tonight. The champions about to get down. You know who's up in the house tonight. The champions are back in your town. Feel the stands and make them shout tonight. The champions about to get down. Welcome into the WBC Arena. We've been waiting a long time to see these two get it on. Alongside me, former world champion Johnny Nelson. About time to. Time for our tale of the tape. Muhammad Ali. He stands six foot three inches tall with a 78 inch reach. And he'll face David Adelaide, known as Big D. Six foot four inches tall, and he packs a lot into those 212 pounds. This is it. This is that fight. This is that argument. I don't know what to expect. Muhammad Ali, the greatest of all time, fighting out of Louisville, Kentucky. Float like a butterfly and sting like a bee. David Adelaide, known as Big D, fighting out of London in the heavyweight division, and he packs a lot into those 212 pounds. You can hardly hear yourself speak. The fans are going mad for this. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. In the red corner, here is the Olympic gold medalist and legend of boxing, the only three-time lineal heavyweight champion of the world. He floats like a butterfly and stings like a bee. The one and only, the greatest, Muhammad Ali. Hiding out of the blue corner, introducing from London, England, here is Big D, David Adelaide. Not too many seats to be had in this arena as the hype continues to build for this showdown. What a night it is. You can hardly hear yourself speak. The atmosphere, the, the people at ringside, this is ridiculous. These two have certainly talked the talk. Now they've got to walk the walk. And there's the bell to start the round. Look at that combo. He's going to loosen things up here. Let's see how he does with this fancy footwork. This fighter is all about finesse, using a lot of angles and... A wise veteran move there to clinch. Sometimes you've got to go with the instincts. Hold on tight till your head clears, till you get your breath back, till the referee steps in. Every time they throw a shot, they get countered. And not throw out a lazy jab in this fight. You'll get knocked out. At some point, the corner has to say you're done. Very competitive round here so far. Didn't wait too long to get back and get engaged. Green Days now needs to steady the pace. Get the Is this the beginning of the end? A nightmare start to this fight. The true champion knows how to get out of trouble after they get into trouble, and that's what he's done right there. What recovery skills they are. What a shot it was. Completely gone, I thought. Smart move there when you're in trouble. Just hold on. I don't know if it's a dancing competition or a fight. 
so much for defensive abilities. And now going for the finish. The referee will begin the count. Ten seconds to get up. I don't see any movement here. It looks like this one's going to be over. It looked great live. How will it look again on slow motion replay? Where did that come from? What a shot. talk about Ali in that last round. Let's see how the game plan changes after that big knockdown. You've been put down, you've got to think right, survive, and then give it back the next round. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. He couldn't finish him off in the last round. Let's see what this has in store for us. What a heavy knockdown. How are they going to come back from that? They staggered back to the corner. They've got to freshen them up, alert them again, get them back on point again. This round, they've got to coast around. Don't get involved. Give yourself another three minutes to get your head clear. An upset of the year, perhaps, right before our eyes. Nice counter punch right up the middle. Quick punch scores. Good counter punching. David Adelaide just took a big shot. David Adelaide couldn't take any more, and down he goes. Wow, that impact was incredible. Let's take another look at it. I've got to see that again. a lot of heart to beat the count there. The corner need to think nice and sharp. They know their fight. They know what their fight is capable of doing and what their fight can and cannot take. This is going to be a tough decision to make. A counter fighter relies a lot on their instincts and reaction time. You've got to get in there quick to punch your opponent before he gets his fist back to block. They have got great ring IQ. Counter punches are the best. They exchange punches. It looks like he's going to survive the round here, but just barely. Every time they drop their guard, they get caught. Let's talk about Ali in that last round. It's not over till it's over, but that knockdown is going to be huge. I love the response, though. Got back up. Took the... They ring the bell, and here we go. Got to get the momentum shift coming their way. What can they do here? Todd, listen to me. If I knock somebody down like that, that round, you know this round coming out? He's getting everything, everything full battle because I know his legs are gone. So this, you watch what's going to happen. If he doesn't, I'll be very, very surprised. Jab not finding its target. That counter punch caught him clean. Hey, sometimes the best thing you can do is to grab your opponent. Had to hold on, getting hurt every time the punches land. That jab doesn't find a home. Well done. The referee really, really thinking about stopping it. I thought that was the end, but here we go again. Back into the fire. Now they've got to wake up. They've got to get on the back foot. Clear the head a little. Do you believe what we are seeing? Good job trying to back out of trouble. It's been a tough round so far. It's been a tough, tough round. What did they do? What did they tell him when he goes back to the corner? How are they going to get through this? The 
perfect counter lands. Nice job getting that punch through. Not so tense anymore, trying to loosen things up. I like it. Despite what the judges score, this may do it. It's all coming to an end. Let's talk about Ali in that last round. Well, it's no secret who has the advantage after that last round. Let's see what they have in store for us in the next one. You can't leave it up to the judges. It's up to you as the fighter. And the tournament's got to put a fight. And there's the bell to start the round. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round. Everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. They call it the glory division. There's what a nightmare scenario. Knocked down hard. I'm not sure that they're going to be able to get back on their feet here as the referee continues the count. Blink and you miss it. Good thing we can watch that over and over again. You're right, Todd. What a shot. people would have predicted it but we've got a knockout victory well there's no argument right there not that you say it not night Ooh.